In this video, you will learn how to use Curo Stopper Disinfecting Caps for open female lures. These caps are designed to fit on a wide range of stock cocks and catheter hubs. Curo Stopper Caps utilize 70% isopropyl alcohol to disinfect critical surfaces of open female lures prior to line access. Their unique design will maintain a closed system and disinfect the critical areas with alcohol. It is important to verify the stopcock valve or catheter clamps are in the closed position prior to using the disinfecting caps. Curo stopper disinfecting caps for open female lures are available individually or in strips of five. Curo strips position the port protectors at the point of care for easy access and to provide a visual reminder for compliance. To use the cap, peel it from the foil. To attach the cap to a stopcock, push and twist clockwise into place until tightly connected. To attach the cap to a catheter hub, push and twist clockwise into place until tightly connected. The cap contains 70% isopropyl alcohol. It disinfects the open female lure in one minute. These caps provide protection for up to seven days if not removed. When you need to access the line, simply remove the cap and discard it. As long as the cap has been in place for one minute or longer, there is no need to scrub. Always follow your institution's protocol for sequential accesses when using Curo stopper caps. Each cap is single use only. Replace with a new cap after accessing the line. If the stopcock or catheter hub is heavily soiled, it must be cleaned with an appropriate disinfectant before using a cap. Do not use a cap if the seal is broken, torn, or punctured. This cap is for open female lures only. It will fit a wide range of stopcocks and catheter hubs. Do not use on needleless connectors. To maintain the integrity of the strip, do not fold the strip, wear it, or place it in your pocket. This will also help prevent cross-contamination that could result as you move from room to room. Curo stopper caps are single-use only. Never reuse Curo stopper caps. After removal, the cap should be discarded and replaced with a new cap. Thanks for your time. You're helping put a cap on contamination.